with another TikTok Tuesday. More ridiculousness coming your way. But nothing quite as ridiculous as John Lubinsky channeling his inner California girl. He, that was one take. One it take. It was one take. Also, I'm told that you were originally going to ask me to do this. Okay, now, you could have done that. You he, so could have done that. He is a dance dad, and he really got into it. And Capable, really maybe, emotionally ready and or willing, no. I, John did have the right touch of sass. He, he well, did. and John is very big on TikTok, and he makes TikToks that are fantastic all he the does. time. He does. They're so, great. I knew he would be gay. Glad and, he stepped up. And he totally nailed it. So I can't wait to see what he comes up with next. Okay, next I think is Tim's TikTok. Oh, really? Okay. Oh. Apparently this is a trend. in number three. Every once in a while it happens. Apparently the people are doing this thing where they show three very different aspects of their lives. I decided to foc on, focus on the three different jobs. What would your three lives be? See, I was trying to think about that. Okay, so obviously, see I living, um, mom, and then I can't think of another one. Friend. I <laughs> <laughs> I thought about doing like friends and family and then, but I, I thought you would do dad. So I, yeah. You do have a lot of jobs, to be fair. I, I do. I had a lot of jobs and uh, sometimes I don't have a problem showing the kids, but I don't show them a lot. Yes, so I, sometimes I, I try not to put that out there as, as much. Yeah. yeah. That's why I made that decision. Well, would your three I don't know. Storyteller, obviously. Sure. Fiance. Fiance now. Fiance, because that's a new personality trait, I guess. The, and uh, then um, the entire TikTok would just be the shininess of the ring. I do a little bit of blacksmithing. Oh, so maybe yes. that. That's Ooh. really out there. Okay. I, yeah. We need to see a TikTok on that. I think. <laughs> yeah, right. actually, that'd she be does cool. Instagram stories on it. Oh, so I should I watch those. Seen. Okay, up next. Okay. <laughs> that go? This is red light, green light, but kind of a take on what often happens. Tim too. Um, when the countdown is on to the show, and we are not in the studio. Red light. Green light. Run for the <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty much how it goes. Yep. So, okay, what would you say, when do you start to panic if you were not in the chair? Like, when our crew does the countdown? Well, luckily, we do our promos at 3 30. So I'm already usually mic'd up, so I don't worry about that. When I wear a dress, that complicates things. It, yes, so like today. Me today too. To get ready. Uh, but <laughs> usually, if I look down, it's like 3.54, I'm like, oh no, I gotta go. Yeah. Yeah, if we're back in the office and I see anything later than 3.56, I'm yeah. usually like, yeah. Row, row. We yeah. have been back there at 3.58. Yes, we have. <laughs> and yes, we have, have made it just in time. But We've did never we ever late. let you down? Did we no. ever not make it? No. We... We've been here every time. <laughs> I think in the history of CI Living, I have been late one time. And that, that's in more than 10 What years. happened? That's they just good. roll like, um, the open? I think I just honestly lost track of time working in the back and then um it's just an empty chair <laughs> I, I think it was when matt was here yeah. it was with matt and i think matt it was just had like, to okay. start without me yes well if that were ever me. to happen again i would step to the plate for you guys oh you're the best you're welcome if you'd like more fun you can follow us on tiktok our username is at ci living and we love your likes your comments your shares um one, one, suggestions. Uh, one comment said that uh they personally have more followers than their local news account, so or their, oh. their local show account. Oh, pitiful! <laughs> help us out. To with help that. us get that number up.